Oxford Read and Discover, Level Three: How We Make Products by Alex Raynham. Introduction. Products are things that we make and use, like clothes, chocolate, computers, and homes. People make lots of products with big machines in factories. People also make products by hand. What products can you see here? What products do you use every day? How do we make these products? Discover. Now read and discover more about how we make different products. Introduction. Products are things that we make and use, like clothes, chocolate, computers, and homes. People make lots of products with big machines in factories. People also make products by hand. What products can you see here? What products do you use every day? How do we make these products? Discover. Now read and discover more about how we make different products. Chapter one: Making products by hand. About two hundred years ago, there weren't many factories or machines. And people made many products by hand. Today, some people still make products by hand. They use tools to make products like chairs, clocks, jewelry, and musical instruments. It takes years to learn how to make these things. People make guitars from wood. They cut thin pieces of wood to make the front and back of the guitar. To make the sides, they put long, thin pieces of wood in water. Then they use hot tools to make the wood the right shape for the sides. They fix these pieces together with glue. Later. They make the neck of the guitar, and they put the strings on it. Chapter One: Making Products by Hand. About two hundred years ago, there weren't many factories or machines, and people made many products by hand. Today, some people still make products by hand. They use tools to make products like chairs, clocks, jewelry, and musical instruments. It takes years to learn how to make these things. People make guitars from wood. They cut thin pieces of wood to make the front and back of the guitar. To make the sides, they put long. Thin pieces of wood in water. Then they use hot tools to make the wood the right shape for the sides. They fix these pieces together with glue. Later, they make the neck of the guitar, and they put the strings on it. Chapter two. Clothes. We make clothes from lots of different materials, like wool and cotton. To make jeans, people use cotton fabric. They cut the fabric into different shapes for pieces of the jeans, like the legs and pockets. They use a sewing machine to sew these pieces together. Then they sew buttons and a zipper. On the front of the jeans, people use wool to make clothes like hats or sweaters. At home, 
Some people use wool and knitting needles to knit clothes. They knit different pieces of the clothes, like the arms, the front, and the back. Then they sew the pieces together. In factories, people use knitting machines to knit clothes. Discover. People don't only knit clothes. Lauren Porter knitted this amazing Ferrari with 19 kilometers of wool. Chapter two, clothes. We make clothes from lots of different materials, like wool and cotton. To make jeans, people use cotton fabric. They cut the fabric into different shapes for pieces of the jeans, like the legs and pockets. They use a sewing machine to sew these pieces together. Then they sew buttons and a zipper on the front of the jeans. People use wool to make clothes like hats or sweaters. At home, some people use wool and knitting needles to knit clothes. They knit different pieces of the clothes, like the arms, the front, and the back. Then they sew the pieces together. In factories, people use knitting machines to knit clothes. Discover. People don't only knit clothes. Lauren Porter knitted this amazing Ferrari with 19 kilometers of wool. Chapter three. Plastic products. We make a lot of products from plastic, like bottles and toys. To make a plastic product, machines put hot plastic in a mold. Then the plastic is the same shape as the mold. To make some products, like bottles, machines also blow air into the molds. To make a new plastic product, like a toy, people draw it and then make a model of it. In a factory, people use the model to make a mold for each part of the toy. Machines put hot plastic in the molds to make plastic parts. People or machines fix the parts together, and they paint the toys. Then the toys go to stores. Discover. It's good to recycle plastic. We can make new things from plastic waste. Chapter three, plastic products. We make a lot of products from plastic, like bottles and toys. To make a plastic product, machines put hot plastic in a mold. Then the plastic is the same shape as the mold. To make some products like bottles, machines also blow air into the molds. To make a new plastic product like a toy, people draw it and then make a model of it. In a factory, people use the model to make a mold for each part of the toy. Machines put hot plastic in the molds to make plastic parts. People or machines fix the parts together, and they paint the toys. Then the toys go to stores. Discover. It's good to recycle plastic. We can make new things from plastic waste. Chapter four. Cars. To make a car, people use a metal called steel to make a strong chassis. 
People also use steel to make big shapes for the outside of the car. Then robots fix the outside to the chassis. A conveyor moves the chassis around the car factory, and people fix many parts on the chassis. Later, other machines paint the car. Then people fix other parts on the car, like the engine, doors, wheels, and seats for people to sit on. There are about thirty-five thousand parts in a car. Discover. Around the world, people make forty-eight million cars every year. This uses lots of steel. We can recycle steel from old cars and use it again. Chapter Four. Cars. To make a car, people use a metal called steel to make a strong chassis. People also use steel to make big shapes for the outside of the car. Then robots fix the outside to the chassis. A conveyor moves the chassis around the car factory. And people fix many parts on the chassis. Later, other machines paint the car. Then people fix other parts on the car, like the engine, doors, wheels, and seats for people to sit on. There are about thirty-five thousand parts in a car. Discover. Around the world, people make forty-eight million cars every year. This uses lots of steel. We can recycle steel from old cars and use it again. Chapter Five. Food. Do you like noodles or chocolate? Do you know how people make this food? People make noodles from grains like rice or wheat. To make rice noodles, people grind rice into flour. Then they mix flour with water to make dough. In factories, machines push dough through holes to make noodles. Some people make noodles by hand. They pull the dough between their fingers. To make chocolate, people take seed pods from cacao trees and leave them in the sun. Then they throw away the outside and keep the seeds. Machines grind and heat the seeds, and then the seeds become a liquid. Then people cook this liquid with sugar, and sometimes milk. They put the liquid in molds to make chocolate bars. Chapter Five, Food. Do you like noodles or chocolate? Do you know how people make this food? People make noodles from grains like rice or wheat. To make rice noodles, people grind rice into flour. Then they mix flour with water to make dough. In factories, machines push dough through holes to make noodles. Some people make noodles by hand. They pull the dough between their fingers. To make chocolate, people take seed pods. From cacao trees, and leave them in the sun. Then they throw away the outside, and keep the seeds. Machines grind and heat the seeds, and then the seeds become a liquid. Then people cook this liquid with sugar, and sometimes milk. They put the liquid in molds 
to make chocolate bars. Chapter 6 Homes We build different homes in different ways. To build an apartment block, people make shapes for the floors and columns from long pieces of steel. Then people put wood around the shapes, and they put a liquid called concrete in them. When the concrete becomes hard like stone, they take the wood away. People build walls to make the rooms in each apartment. They put wires in the walls to carry electricity, and they put pipes in the walls and floors to carry water. They often fix tiles on the floors and on the walls in the bathroom and kitchen. They put plaster on the walls. Then they can paint the walls. Discover! This apartment block in Germany has a garden on the roof. Chapter 6 Homes We build different homes in different ways. To build an apartment block, people make shapes for the floors and columns from long pieces of steel. Then people put wood around the shapes and they put a liquid called concrete in them. When the concrete becomes hard like stone, they take the wood away. People build walls to make the rooms in each apartment. They put wires in the walls to carry electricity, and they put pipes in the walls and floors to carry water. They often fix tiles on the floors and on the walls in the bathroom and kitchen. They put plaster on the walls. Then they can paint the walls. Discover! This apartment block in Germany has a garden on the roof. Chapter 7 Books Many people made this book. Do you know how we make books? An author writes the words, and an editor checks the words. Other people draw pictures or take photos for the book. Designers use a computer to put the words, photos, and pictures into pages. In factories, printing machines print the pages on paper. They print 16 pages on one big piece of paper, then other machines cut the paper into pages. People used machines to fix the pages of this book together. Sometimes people sew the pages together, then they fix them to the cover with glue. Discover! Every picture in a printed book is made of thousands of very small red, blue, yellow, and black dots. Chapter 7 Books Many people made this book. Do you know how we make books? An author writes the words, and an editor checks the words. Other people draw pictures or take photos for the book. Designers use a computer to put the words, photos, and pictures into pages. In factories, printing machines print the pages on paper. They print 16 pages on one big piece of paper. Then other machines cut the paper into pages. People used machines to fix the pages of this book together. 
Sometimes people sew the pages together. Then they fix them to the cover with glue. Discover. Every picture in a printed book is made of thousands of very small red, blue, yellow, and black dots. Chapter Eight: Electronic Products. Cell phones, digital cameras, and computers have lots of very small electronic parts inside them. Circuits carry electricity around a product. Microchips are parts with thousands of small circuits inside them. They make a product work. To make a cell phone, people put computer programs on a microchip. Then they fix the microchip and other electronic parts on a circuit board. People make the phone case from plastic. They fix the circuit board and parts like the screen and camera inside the case. Then they put the front and back of the case together. Discover. Cell phones were very big before there were small electronic parts like microchips. Chapter Eight. Electronic products. Cell phones, digital cameras, and computers have lots of very small electronic parts inside them. Circuits carry electricity around a product. Microchips are parts with thousands of small circuits inside them. They make a product work. To make a cell phone. People put computer programs on a microchip. Then they fix the microchip and other electronic parts on a circuit board. People make the phone case from plastic. They fix the circuit board and parts like the screen and camera inside the case. Then they put the front and back of the case together. Discover. Cell phones were very big before there were small electronic parts like microchips. Chapter Nine. Computer games. To make computer games, people write computer programs. People also make digital characters for the games. To make a digital character, people make a drawing. Then they use a computer to make the picture into a digital skeleton made of lines. On the computer, people can move the skeleton, and they can see it from different sides. Then they add a face, clothes, and colors. Sometimes, to help to make a digital character, people use machines called sensors. A person wears the sensors. The sensors tell a computer how the person moves, and the computer makes a moving picture of the character. Then, computer programs move the characters on the screen. When people play the game, people play a new game to check it. Then they sell the game on the internet or in stores. Chapter Nine: Computer Games. To make computer games, people write computer programs. People also make digital characters for the games. To make a digital character, people make a drawing. Then they use a computer 
to make the picture into a digital skeleton made of lines. On the computer, people can move the skeleton, and they can see it from different sides. Then they add a face, clothes, and colors. Sometimes, to help to make a digital character, people use machines called sensors. A person wears the sensors. The sensors tell a computer how the person moves, and the computer makes a moving picture of the character. Then computer programs move the characters on the screen when people play the game. People play a new game to check it. Then they sell the game on the internet or in stores. Chapter Ten: Products and Our World. When we make products. We use energy like electricity. To make one car, we use the same energy as someone watching television for one hundred years. We also use materials and make waste. To make one car, we make about twenty-eight metric tons of waste every day. People throw away millions of products, like toys, cans, and bottles. Most waste goes to landfills, and sometimes people throw waste in other places, like rivers. This is bad for our world. It's good to recycle old products. We can use materials from old products to make new things, like this bag. We can recycle old products, like plastic bottles, metal cans, and clothes. At recycling centers, people sort the old products. Then machines use the old products to make recycled materials. We can use these materials to make new products. Chapter Ten: Products and Our World. When we make products, we use energy like electricity. To make one car, we use the same energy as someone watching television for a hundred years. We also use materials and make waste. To make one car, we make about twenty-eight metric tons of waste every day. People throw away millions of products like toys, cans, and bottles. Most waste goes to landfills, and sometimes people throw waste in other places like rivers. This is bad for our world. It's good to recycle old products. We can use materials from old products to make new things, like this bag. We can recycle old products like plastic bottles, metal cans, and clothes. At recycling centers, people sort the old products. Then machines use the old products. To make recycled materials, we can use these materials to make new products.